Being a champion takes hard work. It doesn't happen overnight and it doesn't take just one thing. To be a champion, you have to have the mindset, the team and the passion to make the dream become reality. My name is Harry Charles and I'm a jumping athlete for Team GB. My riding journey started pretty much when I was born. My dad, um, he rode and I've done it all my life. It's just, all I can remember is horses being in my life. So uh, I've grown up around them and they're still very much uh, part of my life. Everything, I mean, horses, I've, as I said, grown up with my whole life around. I mean, I walk out my house and I'm surrounded by horses. So, uh, you know, they are very much part of our family. They are family to us and, you know, they've given us a great life and they allow us to our job to, you know, do what we love, which is, you know, every person's dream. You know, we're probably the most unique sport and, and there's two athletes, one, we don't speak the same language. So um, having that relationship, building that partnership up and, and competing and, and winning is very, very rewarding. And, um, you know, we get to travel the world with, with our horses and see amazing places, do great things and, you know, Again, we get to compete at the Olympic Games, which is the highest level for any athlete. So to do it together is, is something really special. This is Romeo. He, ah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's very hungry, as you can see. He thinks my fingers are treats, but um, he's been one of the best horses, if not the best horse I've ever ridden. You know, he, he's done so much for my career and our family especially. He'd be uh, lucky enough to do the Olympic Games last year in Tokyo and he'll be um, my partner for the World Championships in Herning this month. So, uh, yeah, really looking forward to that. He's quite a friendly chap. He'll be quite grumpy sometimes, but, you know, he, he's he's tough and he's he's loves the job. So he, uh, he hopefully has a very good chance next month. I wouldn't say we're perfect just yet. I know there's things we can still improve on, but um, I think we, we make a pretty good partnership these days. So uh, I don't know, we, we've taken time. It wasn't, you know, it didn't click instantly, so to say, but um, we've taken time to get to know each other. And yeah, we're a good team now, I think. Well, I'm lucky enough to have a fantastic groom, Georgia, uh, who does, spends all her time with Romeo spend as much time as possible. I also have to spend time with his teammates, making sure they're good. We know we have a busy stable and busy yard, but um, you know, he's a pretty easy horse to, to deal with, really. He um, makes our life easy and he always brings a smile to everyone's face, so it's a joy to work with. Major competition this year, um, it's you know, the highlight of the year, so Normally will be the, the biggest jumping we'll do all year. So this week we're in Hickstead and uh, he's doing some national classes, what, about 1m30, 1m35 really, just to get him feeling like he's the king of a ring and it's make everything really easy for him. So when he comes in next week, he's, he's cocky, he's confident and uh, he finds them big jumps easy. You know, it's, it's not just one thing, it is a combination, it's, you know, you see me in the ring and the horse, but it takes more than that. It's a village, you know, uh, from our team at home, we care for the horses, you know. I have my dad, my trainer, so many people come together to make, give it success as it is. It's, it's really a combination of factors and everything has to happen, luck as well. Um, but you know, hard work, passion, and determination, you know, a lot of patience and self-belief. I think the sport is, uh, you know, it's a, it can be physically demanding sometimes, but m mentally demanding it really is, you know. So uh, being strong up here and believing in yourself, believing in your horses, believing in your training, everything comes together and then hopefully you have a champion. <laughs>